Hello YouTube world, this is Alex the Gaming Teacher, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Pokemon the Trading Card Game. Okay, so where we left off is Mr. Mickey Mouse again. Oh yeah, that's right. So if I just walk like this, he will stand still, but if I'm right next to somebody, walk against him. Yeah, I don't know, some weird stuff here. Wait a second. Are you serious? Why does this make it sound like we were just meeting him? I, um... I don't know. I don't think the deck... Maybe the deck is still the exact same? Oh, here's a good one. Pikachu and Raichu. Let's hope that he doesn't have anybody. Let's see here. Ah, okay, well. Oh, should I probably go with Rattata? Okay, well, um, let's see what else does he have. Oh, trousies. Well, might just evolve to Raichu right away then. Look at that, he's gonna have an army of. Oh. Wait a second. Let's just check this out though. Hypno. Needs three psychics, so I know for a fact he cannot attack him next turn. So then, Raichu, yeah, we just need to give him one water energy, he'll still be able to attack. So we'll just do Spark, and then we'll evolve it afterwards. Although if he had an energy removal, then, no, well then, I guess until then, maybe we'll just... Ooh, look at this, I'm gonna get you set up for using Thunder at the end. Let's keep it to acting the one that you put the energy card on. I'm gonna make this a quicker battle than the last time we saw him. Now, Farfetch should be weak against um, Electric's right. Sure thing. Okay. I just do this right now. Look at this, we're gonna be able to take out two and one. I love her. Nope, we're good. You know, I could actually just put that no, because I just put all these energy cards. It was like I'm being of all the other Pikachu instead. Not often we get two and one. I like the buzz, alright. This is basically in the bag. And your retrieval. Oh, there, there you go. So your. Is that Leak Slap? Failed, so then basically. Profit's not gonna be able to do anything unless we, um. Unless it has the three energy cards. Alright. Let's just go ahead and evolve it right now. Thunder will, uh, I'm not sure how much damage it could possibly take, but... Oh, 30 damage. Okay, that's fine. Brings in another Pokemon. Hmm. Well, the risk of, you know, making you faint. It's so whatever. We'll end the battle right now. Ugh, okay. But I, um, I don't know. I can feel like that, you know, Wupeg could actually fight this guy all infinite amount of times. Wait, what? 
Oh, I see. We have to put something out first, but... Well, let's just see here. I think we're pretty much going to be getting the same cards. Oh, Beedrill. That's new. Right? I don't think we had a Beedrill yet. Resistance uh, fighting types. That's actually... Well, here's the good thing is that, yeah, there's one attack where you don't need grass energy, so... I can have maybe a party of a Beedrill, Butterfree, others that resist against fighting, but... Most of them could just be, like, the colorless. So I'll have to think about that. But it's gonna mainly be a Psychic deck, though. I would say. Well, Venomoth is actually a pretty good one, too. Oh. That's another one there. I definitely have to keep that, because, you know, about Psychic is that... Well, there is Haunter, but... I don't know. Oh, look at that. You can make them poisoned and confused. Oh, that is so bad. My gosh, I do not want to go against a Venomoth. You know what? That's probably we're going to be encountering right away. This next place we're going to go is the Grass Club. Okay, well, I don't... I guess that was just an extra battle then. But, you know, it's whatever, because we got four decks. So let's just see here. Hmm, I'm gonna check something out here. So what is this then? You can build a deck. This deck can only be built if you dismantle another deck. What? No. I, I don't even know what the heck that's supposed to be for. Oh wait, this says though... Oh. But then no, because it's gonna get, it's gonna basically make my deck go back to default. So honestly, I'm not even sure what's the purpose of looking at this stuff here. Yeah. Forget about that. Alright, then what we're gonna do now is go to the Grass Club. We gotta edit this deck big time. Take out basically everyone here. If you think about it, they were useful for the electric, but now. Yeah, this is basically their weakness. We don't want them at all. It would not be a good ending. Okay, so it looks like we'll have to take out the Mysterious Fossil then. You're gonna be pointless for this fight. Or this... place. Oh. Do I want to, uh... include Persian... and Meowthier? I think I'd rather go with the one with the Cat Punch. The one of them chosen at random. What does Pounce do? Hmm. Huh. Okay, well, first of all, let's make sure we... I don't know, maybe we should just go all out with fire types. Yeah, man, we could even just... put that Arcanine there. Maybe we'll go ahead and do that then. And maybe we'll just put two Growlis. Keep one Ponita, one Rabidash. Not sure about the other Magmar though, but um, yeah, what the heck? Maybe we'll just put you in there. And Moltres, yeah, I'll do that as well. Okay, energy cards. Oh gosh, that would be nice if we had take out all the fighting ones. Oh, we have one double colors of energy. Jesus, look at look at all this stuff though. It's like it's, it's almost like we need to have other Pokemon. Okay, that's right. I think I said I'll just put psychics as well. So if that's the case. 
Let's put Mewtwo. Was spacing out? No. I don't know if I really want that though. I have no idea what I'm gonna do here. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, um... Okay, and I guess that's what we'll do. I know we have a couple fire types, so they don't necessarily need all fire to attack. Now, of course, I could have just countered with grass types myself, but... Nah, I think we'll just leave it like this. We'll see. If anything fails, then we'll have to, um... That's a lot of psychic energy, though, just for... Let's look at the training cards, then maybe... This be more useful. Oh. Well, that's probably a good one, then. Energy removal. Ooh, Pokeball. And actually, Computer Search is actually a good one, too, right? So, uh, maybe that's what we'll do. Okay. Oh, you know, Folio might be a useful one to have. I don't know. What does Pokemon Flute do? Oh, it says, choose an opponent's dis choose a Pokemon from your opponent's discard pile. That's something to think about. Uh, it's, at this time, I don't know if I want it. Okay, we'll just take out three of these then. I'll just leave it like this. Alright, I think one of the trainers might be sitting at this table here, so... I'm checking my phone quickly. Let's talk to everybody here first. I don't see any flowers around. Wait, what? You would give me a Vileplume if I give you an Oddish. Do I have an Oddish? Let's just check this out. Oh, I do have an Oddish. Ooh, this is actually good. Because I have two of them, but I have no Vileplume. Um. Nah. Okay, do that. Good to get the whole group set up. What's this? Once during your turn, you may flip a coin. If heads from one damage counter from one of your Pokemon. Eh. Okay, well, nice thing about that is that you can do it every single turn. Ooh, pedal dance. Okay, well, it's fine. Yeah, whatever, I'm not trying to join the club, I'm trying to defeat you guys. Wait, what? Okay, no, I'm pretty sure we'd be able to fight her, we just need to defeat again all the trainers. Okay, so this person here, etc. I think she's... Yeah, there's only like one of each club where I think they really have mostly the same... Um... Energy type. It's not this one though. Look at that Moltres. Ooh. We definitely don't want to put Moltres right away though because we want to give it some time to breathe. Um. Now, hold on a second. Okay, let me just check. What does the ball fire do again? Yeah, see, that would be pointless. So, start with Growlithe. Oh, we got a Pokeball, so maybe we could go for the Arcanine as well. Got my chop, though. My goodness. Oh, 
Oh, you know what then? I freaking would have been better to have Moltres out. Alright, well, let's just do this right away. It's that way. Ah, fudge. Well then, let's see here. Ooh. Hello. That's an also good one. Alright, I'll put you out there. What else did she have, though? Charmander. Maybe I'll just use Growlithe as, like, bait. Just freaking... I'm not really sure if I want to attack with it. Um, but we'll put Mewtwo out first. And yeah, just start beefing up the Moltres. Sorry. I already had some action before with Growlithe. Actually, no, I don't think I even... I think I just went straight to Arcanine before I attacked. Yeah, so we're gonna keep getting all these fire energies. So basically using as bait and... I don't think they even say in the strategy guide like what their whole deck is, but... Now let's see here, you know what this is actually also a good strategy is that... Alright, that's what I'm gonna do. I will... Use fire on Growlithe, just so I can retreat... Tumultuous, because then what I'm gonna win with the Mewtwo is that he'll be able to, uh, Take back that fire with his attack of energy absorption. Okay, well, it's fine. I should have done that sooner. Oh boy, what are you gonna go for? Yeah, okay, that's fine. So you got two fighting. Moltres will resist. It's bringing all this fire. We need to get a second psychic, though, so if I want to get you two there. Yeah, wildfire, though. Again, what does it do? If I do that, then that means discard the top three cards from the opponent's deck. <laughs> There's no reason to do that. Well, there's a grass type. Oh. Computer search. We will, um... Deal with that one later, but for now... Alright, so you need to get a heads here. Ah. Take one, fail. There's a full heal. Alright, let's see what it looks like. Oh, look at that. That's literally Moltres, it's right there. He threw himself onto the screen, or the other side where Metropolis was at. And yeah, basically, well, I'm gonna take damage here. But basically, that <laughs> dive bomb will take anyone out. Alrighty then, let's... Start beefing up Mewtwo here. Magmar in? Eh, not sure. We should be fine though. We'll just probably take some hits and he faints. I believe we saw Dive Bomb once. Eh. Now one thing I might do is like maybe if I can look if it looks like he's about to faint, then maybe I will use wildfire. Right, we have this one too. So trade one of the other cards in your hand for up to two basic energy cards from your discard pile. That's actually not bad. Then if you use Moltres and Wildfire, then you can use this thing here. Let's not forget about Mewtwo, or if I use Energy Absorption. But now it's there it only goes straight to Mewtwo. Okay. We got a second dive bomb here. Moltres got his action in. And another Charmander. Oh, look at this, a Ghastly with just 30 HP. Oh, that's not gonna... Yeah, okay, it doesn't even matter. Oh, never 
mind. Maybe we'll still be able to use it. Okay. Well then, um... I'm thinking... Yeah, we don't really have to use energy absorption now. So what the heck? I don't know what the heck I want to do. Oh my gosh, seriously. Oh, you know what? This is what I'll do. You're still asleep. How about I use full heal? Um, I'm just gonna retreat for serious. Yeah, just so I can end this, like, right now. Oh, freaking, I totally forgot. Oh my gosh. Okay, that's fine. Nothing happened there. Okay, we should be able to win here, so I'm not gonna deal with anything else. Wait a second. Apparently, Ghastly's not weak to... Psychic? Alright. Stun's pouring out does damage. Never did that before. But, uh, I guess we won't be able to tell. Look at this. We got the Arcanine with... Okay, well then maybe... What do I want to do here? I have no idea what I want to do. Maybe we'll just uh, end this with Magmar. Can't attack here. We'll see. Huh. I'll do this one. Um. It's energy retrieval. Oh my gosh, we have two computer searches here. Well then, let's take out one of them. Yeah, maybe I'll just try to beef up Magmar so we can just use Flamethrower. It's not often I'm gonna be seeing that move, so. I could have just, you know, waited my turn out. Oh my gosh, do we have three Charmanders in here? No. Okay. Don't have to do anything here. Well, if I wanted to, though, let's just use this move. Ah. Yeah, that's crazy, though. It's too bad that Mewtwo doesn't have, like... You know, Cyber is not a super strong attack, but... Alright. Actually. That's not so bad. You could actually even kind of go back and forth. That's kind of a strategy to keep in mind, because then you can use energy absorption to just bring back those two that we disposed of. Okay. Fire Punch. I guess that we haven't seen that one as well, but no. Flamethrower. Take this out, and now victory is ours. was never really in doubt this battle but what do we get here Parasect now oh, just basically nothing new oh, look we got another otter so oh and another battle boom so get them really have to make that tree nah 
Okay, well, I think we're good to go with the next ones. So yeah, the leader is not here at the moment. So who do I go with next? I think this one here has um, something else. It's not a different type of deck, but I know it's the one where the off is there. Yeah, I believe it's this one, Heather. Oh, there you go, three members of the Grass Cub. Grass Club. Grass Cub. Kaleidoscope. Yeah, what the heck's... Oh, wait, does that mean bug Pokemon, or I don't know. Oh, look at that. Mewtwo again, and Magmar. Literally my last two entries in the last battle. Oh my gosh, this is not good, though. I have no energy of cards. Well then, um, let's just put, let's put them all out there. Oh, I do have a switch though, so I, I mean, it shouldn't take long for me to get an energy card. There we go. Okay. Ooh, this is new. Before we go on, check it out. So conversion one. So it's only got 30 HP though, so this is not that big of an issue, but he can, uh, or I guess she can, conversion 1 means, depending on Pokemon has a weakness, you may change it to a type of your choice. Wait, what? What do they mean? Are they talking about me? If the Defending Pokemon is weak, you may change it to a type of your choice other than colorless. Oh. So basically, you can change Charmander to somebody else. And then change Porygon's resistance to a type of your choice, so then you could choose it to be resistant to fire. But if it's resistant to fire, then it won't be resistant to psychic anymore, so. Look at this. Both of them are Porygons. Well, this will be a little bit new. But for conversion 2, you'll need two color cards. So let's see here. You change the weakness of Charmander to Electric. Yeah. I mean, where's she gonna go with that? Does she have Electric in, coming up in her deck? Uh, ooh, okay. Computer search. I'm gonna keep that one in mind. I mean, it's probably not gonna matter. We'll see if I even. Wait, what? Okay, so that's just the weird thing. So we're gonna go back all over the place here. Okay, so Psychic. Let's give that to Mewtwo. I suppose, you know what? Maybe I should give it to Charmander because then you can use Ember. Oh, well, there you are. But you know, again. Huh, well. Alright, what's this gonna be? Change the resistance of ah oh there it is greatness all right ooh so this is what I should probably do is if I'm not miss you know let's probably be conservative give Charmander psychic energy. Um, oh, I'm not sure about this. Okay, let's just um, attach and then we'll just use a switch. Because if I go to Mewtwo, then she's going to probably then say, Oh, you know what? Fine, I'll convert back to being resistant to Psychic. And you know what? I'm just going to scratch you anyways. Just to make sure you don't take damage. Alright. Fine though. I wonder if I should do that every single turn though. I doubt it. Okay. So we'll go ahead and use switch. That way Charmer doesn't have to lose anything there. And you know, once again, you two, Cyburn. Feel the burn of the Psy. The Psychic. 
Okay, though, we're gonna have to go back to uh, Charmander now. Oh boy. And what Mewtwo here is. How come Mewtwo doesn't have a lot of HP, though? It's like, that's not right. Okay, maybe we ought to, uh, computer search here. Let's just forget about Kadarva, because it seems like these are all normal types. And maybe... Well, there's... Oh, well, it's not going to matter, but you know what? Whatever. Actually, maybe I'll just try to get Charmeleon in. That's what I'll just do instead. Okay, so retreat. Maybe I should have retreat. Mm -hmm. No, it doesn't really matter. Okay. I don't really want to use Ember because then he's going to lose a fire energy card. Oh, snap. Wait, what's this going to do? Oh, goodness. So, we can use Bite for 30, or if we use Rage, 10 damage plus 10 more for each damage counter. Oh my gosh, are you serious? So, okay, that's fine, because I think Charmeleon... Yeah, I have enough to take it out with the Flamethrower. Now, what does she have here? A Ditto. Oh, that'll be a new one. We'll have to see what that looks like. Go flanked over again. Okay. We'll basically have this one over in a flash. Well. Now, never mind, because look, remove all damage counters for the rest of the game. Replace it over the copy of a basic Pokemon card. What? Now. Nah. No time to waste here, let's just finish this one now. Of course I could have just played around and waited for Charizard, but eh. I think I'm kind of over that now. Do want to get to all these because the gym leaders or the metal leaders. Those fights could take a while. Okay, nothing good here. Ooh, I don't think we've got a Kangaskhan yet. Although, I look at him though. Yeah, well, that's why we have those double colors energy. They're gonna be getting a lot of Abras and Tangelas. More or less the same cards, but. Okay, this one though I think has mainly grass all over, so let's be able to tune up to the Metal Leader. I'd rather value than um, be dealing with plants. So I believe that her deck is mainly fire or no grass types. Okay, though, again, it all really all comes down to like if I'm stuck with only one Pokemon for a while. Oh. F Ooh. Ah. Well. Okay, I'll just put Moltres out there then, so we can take some hits. Because then we might be able to see Kadabra in action. Oh gosh, she only has one though. What does she got? Oddish, of course. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think we might just wait on that defender. Oh wait, let's see here. What is, uh, Kadabra? Oh, that's not gonna help. <sighs> I guess I won't... I don't know. I'm not gonna even maybe give anything to Moltres, because... Oh, yeah, yeah, I have no idea what I want to do. I'm just gonna bring more Oddish into our... ...play area. Alright, you know what, then maybe we should just freaking do it. Oh, 
How many Oz does she have in the deck anyways? Okay, there we go. There's one. Super side. Nothing happens there, so... <sighs> if only we had the Psychic already, then I'd just switch out now. Of course... Okay, I'm guessing she does not have any more Oddishes. Oh, yes! But I need freaking... I need the Psychic Energy. Although... As often as you like... Let me move one damage counter from one of your Pokémon. Oh. We need, we need more on the bench then. Okay, though. Maybe I ought to do it right now. Evolve. Alakazam. Oh, no, what the fudge? I should've... I should've gave fire to the Moltres here. Well, it, you know, it probably doesn't really matter if we don't get energy card in the next draw here. Okay, we did, though. Oh, well. Um... Wait, did I evolve the cadaver yet? Okay, though, this is not looking good. We need other... Okay. We did not evolve cadaver yet. Okay, so computer search. I... Anybody that has like a lot of HP. Here's the thing though, is she gonna if she falls into gloom then that's not good. Okay, we're gonna have to get Alakazam in this next one here. It's Charmander. Okay, so I'm gonna go. We have a Charmander on the bench. Demonstrate the power for damage swap. Because... I don't know if we can do this over and over again, but, um... Yeah. We can't knock him out, though. So we'll just probably put one on Alakazam himself. <laughs> and look at that. All of a sudden, Moltres. And you know what? Maybe, uh, computer search. Let's take out... Ooh, I could try to bring in the Charizard. Maybe we'll do that. I don't know. I kind of wanted to bring in Alakazam, but... Do we have a Charmeleon anywhere here? We do, so... Okay, we just put him on the bench, though. Ah, jeez. Alright, I don't know what the heck I'm doing. Because Charizard, basically, that's one that has a lot of HP, so... Oh. Well, that's not gonna matter, but... Okay, we just need energy cards, man. We basically got the group. I don't even know if she even has any evolution cards. That, that can't be right, because... Oh, let's definitely do this. Um... Okay. Alright, this is what we're gonna do. Bring in the fire first. Psychic. Actually. Maybe Bill. That way we can then do Psychic, Energy Search. And then we'll shuffle it. Magmar, unfortunately, will not show up. Okay, the Charizard. 
Um, we'll use damage swap here. Keep stopping onto Charizard. Yeah, so I'm probably not gonna have Charizard fight. We're just gonna use it there to take in some, you know, take some bait. Not bait, but like, spur this damage here. So it's crazy how this whole time I have not done one single bit of damage, but her whole freaking deck is what just oddish. I, I don't even get this. But here we are, finally. Now, need heads. We got it. And how much damage this is going to do? 160. Phew, no one can stand against that. Oh, look at this. We got a switch. That's great. So that's what we'll do, and I'm just gonna go with Alakazam, since I already had Moltres in the previous fight. Wait a second. When did I, uh... I don't remember seeing Switch when we did the Pokedex. Wait... I don't know... Oh, no, that was a prize we got. Okay. That's cool. Okay, then, um... I guess we'll just try to attack again. That's fine. Oh, there you go. Finally, that's somebody else. I'm just about to say, it can't be all oddish. Oh, this is where I'm gonna demonstrate the power of full heal. I'm sure, I know what full heal does, but oh, I was supposed to use energy search. That was okay. Whatever. Got it now. Alright, and this is where I'll go ahead and... Actually, no, we don't need to use Fold Heal. We'll switch to Alakazam. And now, what I'm gonna do here... <laughs> it's like, hey, I was actually helping you out, Moltres, but now I'm gonna give you some of this damage. Actually, no, we'll give it to Charizard. And let's... Alrighty then. See if Oddish can knock itself out. Basically, I'm much, much stronger confused right than what Drowsy has. Oh, God, you're trying to retreat, you little coward. And of course, though. Ah, whatever. I'll go use Full Heal now. I'm not gonna wait this out. Ooh, energy retrieval. Is this? Oh, nothing in discard pile. I bet she's gonna. I bet she's gonna try to retreat again. Let's see. Oh yeah. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Come on now. What is? Oh heck no. That would have been good to have full heal. Oh gosh. Okay, well, we're certainly gonna then have to beef up Charizard if we have to just... Now that's basically what it is. Straight up. This is not good. I'm gonna have to, uh... I might do Charizard though again. You have to discard two energy cards. Ugh, dang it. This is unbelievable. I'm gonna have to just do this here then. Alright though, one good thing is that... Okay, didn't get confused, but... One more confuse ray. Take this Ivysaur out. Oh my god. Gosh. Okay, you know what? This is ridiculous. All this freaking time, you had nothing, and then all of a sudden... Um, well, there goes my, uh, pff, damage swap. And that was so pathetic, because now, all that stuff I moved from Alakazam... 
Okay, um... Well, good. We have that at least, so therefore... Charizard... Gotta make sure Magmar goes on the bench now. Um... Well, take our chances. Alright, got you. Uh, Venusaur looks pretty intimidating. Okay. Catch my brother for seconds. I think I'm gonna go ahead and switch out to uh, Charizard probably now. How much do we have to get rid of? Just two, okay. Actually, that's fine because now we'll go ahead and use Energy Retrieval. You know what? I'll just take out that Charmander. Yep, and we definitely do not want to get rid of the double colorless energy because that takes up two slots. Oh, you know what? I should have just had Charge I go against Venusaur. What was that? 200 damage, right? Oh, look at this. I'm going to use plus power. Wait, what? Snap. Oh no. Oh fudge, she's not even gonna have the chance to attack again. And what's his retreat cost? <laughs> Unbelievable. Alright, well then fine, we'll just use it for Magmar. Actually, no. Let's make sure I can afford to... Ugh, jeez. Yeah, but as you can see, though, I just needed to have fire types. I had Moltres only for a while, and I couldn't attack at all. All those Oddishes have been gone in Flash. Okay, so this will do. I want to use Venus plus power. Okay, that's it. This is our victory. Um... Don't use smoke screen though. Yeah. Alright, and poison bulb zones. Already a poison type, but. Well, he we finally now encountered the last remaining starter, Venusaur. Now, what I'm wondering is that when will we ever get a Venusaur? Ooh. Golem here. Pretty strong. And Pidgeot. So that's another one though. So when I go against the Fighting Club, you know I was thinking about Psychic, but I think it might be a better idea to go with a group like, you know, Beedrill, Butterfree. Then again though, the problem is Their primary stages, they're not resistant to fighting, so. Oh. Definitely use, though. Ghastly Haunter and all. Okay, but what else? Metapod. Move oh, a Cavalry and Metapod. Oh. That's what I'm looking forward to. Nidoking. King very strong, because look at this toxic. It'll, it'll take 20 damage each turn instead of 10. Thrash. Okay. There's another Butterfree. Oh, what? Have to go to Ishihara's house then. <laughs> it's like how fast you just walk across the uh, map there. Yep, that's what I thought. You're not gonna be doing right over here.
Now, since you just got a compliment, how about a trade? Whatever. I don't know if you have to... Oh, maybe you have to have... I think just like, he wants four cards, not just one. Okay, so I'm gonna have to take a look at this. We don't have the middle queen though, but um, that's right, that's another one. You know what, then maybe I will roll with it, because, um, no Zubat. We got Zubat with Golbat. Oh, we don't have a Venom now though, but you know, Venomoth would be a really good one too. What is this? You may change the type of Venomoth to the type of any other Pokemon in play. Oh. But it will still be resistant to fighting, right? But if I was able to switch it to be a Psychic type... Huh. Um... Ooh, Scyther. Yeah, it's also resistant. That's actually a good one then, because look at that. Three colorless. Just definitely have to keep Scyther on the list. That's what I'm looking at. Oh, but here's the thing. We need Pidgeotto. Spiro, but there's no Firo. Farfetch'd. Not even thinking of that. There's no Dodrio. <laughs> Dragonite. Look at that. We get a Dragonite, but then... Where's Dracini? Where's Dragonair? Alright though, the Fighting Club... Oh, you know what? I don't know if that's gonna be the next one we're gonna try to go for. It's gonna be that one, or it might be the... Science, which I kind of think was like a poison... Uh... It's all about poison... Types. Okay, well... We'll just get ourselves in here. I got a seasonally like carried out the music. Grass type is the same thing as this one here. It is. So the first two were like all pretty calm. Now something else. Okay. I'm able to go through these. I am. So Nikki. Let's keep a diary here. We're going to take you on the next one. So, that's for everybody else. Thank you guys all for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, then please smash that like button and subscribe to my channel if you've not already. And if you have any questions or comments of anything at all, then just put them in that comment section right down below. And other than that, I will see you all next time.